series of the day. It's going to be Vitality taking on Complexity right here, right now. And for all of you out there watching in Freeland, which is exactly where you're watching all these matches, we hope you enjoy the show. We could try a little science experiment here and be very bland and boring and dull throughout the first half of play and really put you to sleep, or we can put you to sleep via laughter. Wipe that smile off your face, oh, Trace, because we're getting into the very important action now between Vitality and Cole. It's a bit of event dive, but one denied is Rush Dead oh. Config. The headshot to shocks and the dink follow up. How does Mizuta get away with a kill there? In all of the madness, the bomb has been planted. Cole aggressing to the ramp, trying to cut off this point of rotation. Two CTs here, Zai Wu, Zai Hu, that's exactly wow. who. And he's going to take down Poison, leaving Vitality a man up. Late Vent Lurk will have no success as all of Vitality are on B already. Oh, but Config with a quick opener. And now, trying to lay down the pain from the decon, he's in with another knife out. Oh, oh. just got flashbacks. Config with the knife onto Zai Wu. And obviously that there is going to give him some bonus money. So that's what we really need to focus on here. Four in that round for Config. A bit more extra cash now in his hands. He can look to maybe bring an early AWP out for Poison, but instead just goes for the AK. Obviously only going to be up against pistols here in this round, or at least, you know, that's, that's what we're anticipating. What a what a statement for a pistol one round. What an opener for complexity. They're already setting the precedent early days. And Vitality are forcing things up. Oh, oh. dear, Brain. Grenaded out of the round immediately. Doesn't get a say in the matter. Wow, what a scout shot. I know oh, by Trace. He's missing all of them. What a crazy scout shot. Yeah, I don't think go. I don't think Do we should uh, we should down this by. I don't think we should push this point any more than we need to, considering the fact that you know vocal vocal minority is always going to be a bit louder than the people who do enjoy the broadcast, and we all appreciate every single one of you, all you fans, vocal or not. If you're liking what you hear, thank you. Even if you don't like what you hear, just think about what you type. That's a great point, Trace. Because, like, Trace is jacked, and you wouldn't say uh, that to him at land. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, he actually, he <laughs> hangs with the chillest dudes. I do hang it with the coolest dudes at land, that's for sure. Oh, cheers, man. I mean, Harry and Hugo, they try to pretend to know pros by first name, but they just... <laughs> come on. It's yeah. just not the reality yeah. of the situation. Yeah, what you want to buy? I know... Uh, uh, nice. What's this guy's name again? I know... Al uh, Al Alf Alfred? Al yeah. Alvin? Alfie? Al Alvin. 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 I know Alvin. Alvin. Like, Alvin. me and Alvin, we go way back. Uh, yeah. Alfie. <laughs> A little bit of a miss there, but uh, nonetheless. Yeah, dude, it's Alvin saving the, the scout. <laughs> Alvin Apex Alvin. <laughs> Alvinson is the scout. Alvinson, yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Alvin Apex Alvinson. Complexity. Oh. They're going to get that second round. So let's, uh, you know, we'll keep it nice and topical. Oh, look. <laughs> you got the ESL Ottoman winter jacket. Well, we don't, but, you know, we could. You we could went too. to shop.eslgaming.com. You look fresh as all hell. I saw Hugo wearing some ESL merch the other day. Just couldn't take my eyes off of him. And it's it's pretty easy that, you know, obviously that attraction between these two gentlemen here, but I'm thinking more of just like, if you love it, you wear it. That is also true. We've done a couple of, you know, publicly funded research uh, studies into that trace. And right now, complexity, they're wearing Vitality like a jacket. Uh, Obo, you cool, mate? A uh, bit of a spam onto Mizuta. That's one way to start a round. This has already been a very confident show for Complexity. We're only a couple of rounds in play. Blame in main, taking down shocks and a grenade to the back of the site. It shouldn't be a problem here for Cole to find a clean sweeping round, but Zaiwu swoops in with a double off the P250, falling in the face of Obo. But he is traded, and Cole wrap it up. 3-0. Here comes the buy for the French. Yeah. So what's up now, internet gangsters? Ha ha ha! Sorry, I just had to, someone had to say it. I don't actually, no one had to say it, but. Yeah, no one did, but you said it anyway. That's yeah. something that can be applied to you a lot, Trace. You know, no one had to say what you said, but, but I didn't mean it wasn't. It was, was said. It, it wasn't said, right? And yeah. yeah. So look, we got the uh, we got the AWP in Zaiwu's hands. He's already had a great start to this game. And I see Zaiwu, I see the AWP. I remember what Zaiwu can do with this gun. And I'm like, yeah, let's see it. So hopefully we get that. He's rotated down early over here towards secret. Down through the B site, rather. Looked like he maybe wanted to head that way, but with that already belonging to complexity, Zai Wu's going to trade places oh, with yeah. the ramp player, Apex. 
Alvin still waiting here in the garage. And oh boy. Oh, he's seen one. Goes for the spray transfer, but comes up a little bit short as Oboe gets that trade. Now it falls to the rest of the chipmunks here on the Vitality side. They're four on four. They're looking outside. They push the lobby and shocks. Does get the better of Rush. So a man advantage taken here for Vitality. As I was ahead of the game, realizing they weren't going lower, Apex got that info from Cole running back up secret. They didn't know how deep he was. And now Cole going back towards B, hoping Vitality haven't pre-rotated. But what have they done? They've pre-rotated. Shox is in the site. Zaiwu's moving in. Config's lurk timing is important here, as he could put the knife in the back of Zaiwu. Obo flashing into the site, and Zaiwu's not even considering it right now. Blame's got the entry. That's going to keep Zaiwu looking at this smoke. But there's Config pouncing. He doesn't know about Zaiwu. Now the tables have turned in favor of the Orpa, and he's got a quick shot as well. Bomb planted, retake opened up. There's a chance, but Blame looks to stop that. Oh dear, catching Mizu. And now he knows exactly where Zaiwu's coming from. Door shut, and now he's going to play with it. Zaiwu swapping off the orb, going to the bomb. Blame waiting for the timing, oh, oh, oh. and he hits it to perfection. Capacity 4-0 up, and they are looking warm. Blame is just so damn good. Like, I, I don't even know. I feel like no matter how much you, pra you praise Blame as an individual, I don't think it would ever be enough to match up just how much effort this guy actually puts into his craft. You know, we had that st stat the other day, about 5% of all the uh, the demos uploaded to ESCA Refrag belong yeah. into him and key to the coach, right? So that's mental. I think when I checked it, they said, oh, it was either 10,000 or 20,000 demos have been uploaded. So that means like every, every 20 demos that were uploaded, one of them belonged to this complexity squad. Yeah, that's some uh, some hard work going in for these Cole guys, and I don't think there's anyone that can deny that. It's been pretty apparent from the building of this roster and everything they've gone through, the Europe move, and even all these really good recent results. They were flawless for some time in EPL. They currently have one loss to their name. Was versus Mal Sports. And now they're looking to keep it pretty clean. Take a win versus Vitality. It's their map pick. It's the T side, and they're about to go up five. That's if Apex doesn't have anything to say about it. He's crept into this close secret, but Mizuta peeking. Ovo catches him, and now Apex, he might have no effect in this round. They're already running towards main. They've got their back turn, but the CZ is a wow. fickle beast and poison. A beast in his own regard. Fights him back. Obo dead, but now they know where Shox is, and Heaven's been mollied. He's going to go for the gun. Poison won't allow it. Yeah, this has looked really good for Complexity to start this one off with the fifth one up on the board. Certainly shocks one kill in the round, but not a whole bunch of HP to go around because Poison's going to take out the remaining bit, and that's five for the Complexity side, the North American organization from North America, but also not at the same time. Shout out one time, Jason One Lake. You can probably find him in the fan cams, which you can also find at esl.gg slash fan cam. That's where they happen to be. And there he is, as promised. Indeed. Never missing a moment. 5 0. They're not missing a shot. Vitality ever buy those. I was back on the orb. He's already banging out Cole, but to no success on rounds. Conflict running out the smoke. Lands on the Molotov. RPK holds strong. Cole Bale, they go back into lobby, and that's where the ramp is aggressed, so Shox gets caught. Obo's in a dangerous position, could get wall banged, but right now, Cole going back towards the ramp room. The orb's already here. Zaiwu with a shot and a drop to B. Look at this. Obo tried to weasel his way out of the hut. This Mizuta is able to eliminate that threat before it ever becomes a real problem, and now the problem is for Blame F and Rush, who have the bomb, who have ramp room, but have no idea where the four remaining Vitality players are. And surely that's going to begin to eat away at the clock here with just over a minute left of play in the round. Full control for Vitality at this point. Yeah, and Apex just got so much info by clearing Lobby from the outside flank. So now he knows that Cole have to be either working B, which I was waiting for, or coming outside from the other side. And that's what they're doing. Cole dropped down, uh, Vitality rather, dropped down the vent. RPK still stays here and Apex can come in to retake A. Are Cole going to go secret to B? Okay. Going for the full tour to nuke. Lobby to ramp to outside to secret to B. They could have just walked ramp to B, but they're trying to spice things up and catch Vitality looking the wrong way. Maybe we can get a camp path for that. One round the world camp path for every map. Bastion. <clears throat> I think we'll talk oh. to MC about that. I mean, MC. 
Oh, Mizuta's oh, right behind. Man, that's a shame for Rush, right? You didn't check it. We'll get the better of Zaiwu, oh. but that's where Mizuta swings. Blame also shut down. And Vitality, can they get their first on the board? So they arrive into this one. Finally, takes them six rounds to get that first one up there. But now that they have, they're looking to chain together a couple. And that was a very nice response to an attempt from Complexity to change up the pace. You know, they try and rush that A site. And uh, Shox as well, like to be fair, had an opportunity to take down like four players on that flank, but he tried to play the trigger discipline. And it was one of those situations where actually holding off gets him killed. They turn around and they just drop him. It almost gave them a way to get back in. Luckily enough, Vitality, they were quick on the rotates. They were helped out by Oboe, executing into that A site still. And so now it's back to the drawing board for complexity. Shox has crossed outside to red. Cole, they're being patient. Convict's watching for the secret play, but he's yet to see anything. So will Cole think the yard is clear? Oh dear, they're setting up smokes as well. This position could be so good. The smokes can just land past him. Shocks might have to go a little bit wider as they could elude his vision, but it's actually the wide smokes. So Shocks remains hidden, remains unknown, and it's all a fake, it's all a ruse. Complexity go back towards lobby. And so Shocks can call, okay, there's no one outside. Just stay on the A site, stay on ramp, because these rotates are not coming through. You don't want to drop B when you have no need to. Mizuta in the hut, almost walked into danger, but he'll bail and Cole setting up for an A play. This is exactly what Vitality are ready for. Three players here and fast rotates available for the ramp. Shox is doubled up. They've left outside, they've gambled, but it's the right call to make. Yeah, last time this A play was dealt with pretty efficiently by Vitality. It's the second time at Charm now. It's not actually the A play at all, it's a ruse. Psych. Complexity heading into the ramp room. Now Zaiwu was able to nail this shot last time and this time there's no problem either. He's in with a second Zaiwu just being a nuisance. Oboe denied the trade as well, even getting wrapped from the lobby and Zaiwu's putting on a show. Blame left scratching his head. This was not how he envisioned this round panning out. Yeah, and it's all the danger of that outside control for Shox, right? Zywu may be the hero of the round with the kills, but the information and the setup comes from Shox pushing red. He knows that there's no one there. He calls the stack ramp an A, and they just leave outside open with no worry. There's no luck for complexity as there has been in the past, and so Vitality able to double up in positions. Shox draws attention. Zywu goes back in for more, knowing he's got that at least to fall back on, and then finds a third on B. Beautiful stuff from Vitality warming into this game. It took some time. 5-0 for Cole, but bounce back for the French. What's Blame got up his sleeve for this follow-up? Well, certainly something. He seems to have an answer for everything else. In this uh, regard, it's going to be the AK on his back. So hopefully he does have the answer for at least complexity's sake. Zaiwu with an open door outside for an AWP. Never mind. There goes that secondary smoke. So the wall of smoke's complete. Zaiwu repositions over to the hell side has no visual as to who's cross and who hasn't. Now, blame Alexa to stay over here towards red, and that's going to be able to create a situation or a dilemma, perhaps even a problem. Do you want to want to rotate in the backside of secret? But it's complexity that have found side hall control. They're busting out the windows, and they're ready to go out on the site. They're not going to be alone, I fear. Ooh. Luckily, blocks on the other side, so it's not a worry. The nade, did that just fully dunk rush? Oh, dear. Apex following up. Shox helps out. Oh, it does get a Glock kill out the window. He's going to run for the gun, but Mizuta has it covered. Uh, Mizuta is looking very good as well in this game. On these lower rotates, three for Vitality. Again, ready for the B execute. I call it an execute. It was an eco for complexity. They had one gun saved from the previous. And just running out the door with pistols, hoping for the best. Not really the end of the world. Money will be building as Loss Bonus is getting acquired thanks to Vitality, giving us a bit of a show. Three in a row. Welcome to the show. It's three in a row. Back to your regularly scheduled programming. Look at this double ramp push. Poison just looking away. Could get caught to the timing here. They hear the flash. They know that people could be aggressive. And they are. Shocks there. Gets the dink, but not the killing blow. Onto Poison. They deal with Zaiwu outside. Masuta is now the only threat that still remains from this ramp push. 
He's going to try and get some usage out of it. He does best poison. Now Rush has to watch his back and look at the hut. He's suddenly been given a lot more responsibility than he was hoping for. Vitality, they just take the straight duel out through main and that drops the bomb. Thankfully, Rush does at least lock in a trade, leaving us into an even odds two on two. Still trying to hold the lobby, but he's got to watch everything. Like he's checking hut, he's checking squeaky. And oh, he's in with another. Rush might have just bailed him out of this one. Blame is still sneaking down into this lower bomb site, looking for the plant and Masuta. Late outside, he's going to hear Rush get down the vent, and now he knows that it is this lower play. Sadly, realizing it a little too late, so he's left in this clutch. No chance to deny that bomb plant, and there's the wrap. Rush in with three, and complexity, they salvage a six. Yeah, Vitality even calling out pause as well. Their rotates have been pretty good, right? Despite Cole being in control of this game right now, Vitality have had good answers to the problems. But obviously, knowing that their money's coming to a bitter end, they're going to have to follow up with a win, or this could be one hell of a T-side for complexity just around the corner. Hack timeout being used. Vitality, not as confident in how things have started here. They're going to have weapons in this round, but guess what? So are complexity. That's how those gun buys go, Trace. Ah, uh, yes, the ever coveted gun buy. Guns getting bought and being used. Gun buy, bye bye. Double orb as well for Vitality. None for Cole. So I will ramp shocks in the door, standard all positions, but shocks get spammed or mollied or something. I think it was the main molly he walked into while scoped up. Cyclops mode looks away from the flash. Cole go back outside late. Apex is here. He's only jumping. Oh, <laughs> we sometimes see people do that and take no damage. Obo. Gravity's not his friend, but it's nothing to be worried about. Mizuta's pushed door. I love this position as well. Shox takes a shot and then backs off. They're not going to be ready for another man tucked in this corner. Smokes outside for Colt. Again, fake smokes, but Shox isn't here to confirm nor deny, but he's going to get that info from the lobby if they walk into his crosshair, and they should to set up Norton aids towards A. There's the shot. Bomb drop, and Mizuta gets checked. Rush is very aware, and out of nowhere, three kills for complexity. The A site is theirs. Ooh, Apex playing around this main smoke. There's a gap in it. He doesn't find anything from it. And in fact, it actually comes back to hurt him. Zai Wu left in a 1v4. Does deal with Blame F outside, but is he even going to give this one a go? Odds pretty overwhelmingly stacked against him. And Hobo's even hunting this kill down on the Hell Wrap. Oh dear. Oh, they've missed each other for now. Zaiwu seems aware and does deal with Obo. Now just looking to hold on to this orb, and he is going to get away with it. It's crazy how many fights like Zaiwu will be versus a rifle with the orb, and will still like right click, left click way faster than the opponent can even aim and left click. Right? You know, there's that extra bit of bit of work. You got to use two fingers instead of one. And Zaiwu, he's a fast in the server. 14 and 7 right now, despite the score being very favorable for complexity. Zywoo's shown up in a big way. That's going to be influential in this series, no matter how long it goes. And, and boy, you know, hoping for a three mapper, especially with Dust 2 to finish. We know how good Vitality are on a map like Vertigo. So Cole have got their work cut out for them. But starting strong, 7 3. Orp for Poison as well. We get to see that. And Zywoo has saved his, right? So there may be a head to head in this round. Zywoo's on the A site. Complexity have been going back to it round after round, but this time they actually push behind the smokes. This is going to be so annoying for Vitality, who in the last two times Cole had thrown these smokes, no one has crossed behind them, but now they're sneaking and there's no information for Vitality. There's no confirmation on this play. And so you can see the minimap. No one's dropped lower because all of Vitality are waiting for is Cole to go back towards lobby and set up a utility. Oh dear, it's the perfect call. And it's going to give them a free B bomb site.
all of this control, yet all of this hit is on B. And you're right, Hugo. B bomb site. Free real estate for complexity. And a quick, clean, crisp kill there on the apex from Rush. So, uh oh, <laughs> that's not good. <laughs> <laughs> and it was at this oh. moment that Rush knew that Mazuda had really flubbed it up. Ooh. That's happened to Obo twice now, where he's <laughs> trying to deal with shocks and just gets one deeged. Rush is looking like really crisp as well. Like every one of his kills looked so effortless. Wow. Face, you said we needed a round the whole map camera. Well, we just pull one out there. Look at this. Whoa. We can go everywhere. Take us somewhere fun. Keep going, Ooh. man. Never stop. Whoa. Roller coaster. Oh, I want to get vertigo. Yeah, that's the second map of the series, Trace. Just be patient. Okay? Well, I, well, I was just thinking like actual vertigo from watching the camp paths. Uh, I'm not happy if I'm not profusely vomiting. That's oh. like the that's the mantra I live by. And boy. Sick to the stomach, our vitality. They get dealt a rough hand. You know, that's, we talk about the word conditioning a lot in a game like Counter-Strike. This is a perfect example with complexity yeah. throwing those outside smokes and like shocks confirming in one of the rounds that, yeah, no, it's just fake smokes, guys. Don't worry about it. And that's Vitality getting conditioned. Will it be a problem again? Zywee's pushed red. He wants to, again, get this information, but the smokes come down. He blocks one. And uh, it's a bit of a, a mess outside with the utility. I don't even know who's throwing what and where and why and how. But all I do know is Cole, nice. they're going Vitality, out the door. Like, yeah, there's there's a lot of smokes outside. I don't really know what it's for. All smokes, no blokes. And now they're trying to, uh, to maneuver around this, and they have actually done a good job of dealing with this A play. It's kind of crumbled down in front of Complexity Blame, left in the clutch. 50 HP, and they know where he is. They know that he's here outside. They've smoked off main. They're not giving him the room. He does have a whole minute left to play with. And, oh, he, I, I thought he saw shocks. I thought he did. And now he knows that Nade has given up the aim of the game for shocks. See, but it doesn't matter. He's going to nail the shot. It's four on the board for Vitality. If you go, what would you say is more important, the conditioning or uh, shampoo? Uh, <laughs> you know, what I can say is definitely don't use two and one. You want them separately. Yeah. Right? You, no, but yeah. I, I, don't, I don't think it's necessarily about the product. It's about the, you know, the actual use of it. And yeah. the, tr the truth is, I don't know, and it honestly, is a 30-year-old male. Okay. I didn't really know. You weren't supposed to use shampoo every single day. I, that's the first I've ever heard of that. You Did didn't you know that? Yeah, you're not meant to shampoo every day. It bleeds yeah. your hair of all the oils and stuff. Yeah. Though. Well, I'm 22 years late to that knowledge, but I appreciate it nonetheless. 30-ish, maybe 40-ish. So. Wow, wait, really? So yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah, I mean, sure. We're probably educating somebody else out there wow. who's, you know, profusely washing their hair all of the time. We would love to talk about this round, but guess what? It's one of those rounds where there's just not a no lot. Trace. Oh, no, 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 Trace. No, 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 These are deagles. No, just saying Anything there's not a lot happen. going on, on yet. Hang on, hang on. <laughs> I'm getting angry. <laughs> <laughs> right, look at this. We got deagles outside. And a oh, <laughs> run, run boosted into C. Okay. And the collateral for Zai Wu. No. Get him out. Uh, config still alive with a Mac 10 in a 1v4. We've seen these moments from him. I remember this exact play from a few years back. Yeah? Yep. Ah, uh, Same yeah. team as well. Which exact team? same team. Here it is, Config creeping down in through secret. Eagles out for the boys. Yes. Pow, pow. It's every two or three days, just to clear that up for you, Hugo. Really? Okay, that's good information. Ooh. I don't know if I'm gonna, yeah, well, I, I guess I should change my ways. You used the conditioner the other day. Like the, the other days that you don't wash your hair and then you use both on the days that you do wash your hair. Yeah. Config, man, he's like, uh, he's showering bullets down the other way onto Vitality. <laughs> Can he find anything else? 15 seconds left for Config. And here he is, tapping that bomb. Not gonna bait a peek just yet. They do delay it. So now he's got that bomb down at least. Looking for Zyru at ramp, Ooh. does deal with him, but that's where RPK swings out of Decon and keeps that all under control. They just don't give Config the room. Yeah, that's important. Zyru kind of like YOLOs into the site, but he knows his team are doing it as well. So there's almost no way that, that they lose the round if they all just go fully in, especially when he's got a Mac 10 you know, the multi-kill weapon against rifles. Nice shots for Zaiwu. catches the run boost, kills a double. Woo! Beautiful stuff. 
And yeah, you can only laugh about that. It was a low buy for Complexity. No real pressure on their shoulders to lose that round. Eight to five. This is a great T side, but boy, could they make it better. And that's their intention. That's their objective. Smokes outside again. Only one up this time, and Poison's peeled away from his. Rush is going to get naded inside of the lobby. He's got the bomb in lobby with three outside. Okay, okay, you've got my curiosity. What are Complexity going to do with this? They've already lost config in the yard. The smoke spam and a follow-up for Obo as he goes through the smokes. Into A, Mizuta with a kill. Down to 20. There's the bomb drop. Rush runs out the heart. Poison needed that kill. And now without it, this round is falling apart. Look at this, though. Blame F is the kind of guy that's knife that, that, that his knife matches his gloves. And that's how you know that Man. he's just straight up balling. Man, that's knife. That is. <laughs> no. That's knife. No, no. Only <laughs> 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 way. Thanks, Sinatra fans now. Oh, that nade did a spell oh, hard, baby. You know, Masuda peeks ahead of it. And so Blame dropped, and now we approach the final round of this first half of play. Complexity, this big old lead that they once had. Well, Vitality, they wanted to say something about it, and they certainly have. They've grinded this one out. They're close to, you know, splitting this half as conceivably close to the middle as you can get. Yeah, and maybe just a quick B-Stream update since we're here already, oh, usually. Oh, yeah, let's do it. We could talk, I mean, we could talk about Shampoo. I mean, there's a lot to be learned there, but much rather, I'm sure you'd know that Gen G beat 100 Thieves in the first map of the series, 16-14. That was Vertigo. They're over on Nuke right now. It's 12-6 for Gen G, who are playing not with Daps. Here we go. Let's get back into it. Obo finds shocks through a smoke, though. Oh, dear. You know, though. I know, though. Apex, though, he's on B, and he's ready for the fight, too, put up by Apex. And that's poor time, Mizuta. The smoke comes down. Does he want to open the door with it? No, he's going to wait. There's a Lurker again, Cole. But they always have this top site Lurk when they're taking this B control through ramp. And Blame could uproot this A site. So he's been chased back to spawn. Blame killing Mizuta up the ladder. There's another one. Switch weapons. And that delays him for enough time to allow RPK to take the A site again. Zaiwu back to ramp through the smoke. No fear. Zaiwu is here, but not for long. As now, Complexity want to long out this round in the two-on-two. -two. They've got to find RPK in main. He is about to drop the bomb if Obo goes any further. And in fact, RPK, he doesn't wait. Just poison left. Tech nine in a dream. Last round of the half. The bomb at the feet of Vitality, and they're swapping guns as well. This is about to get a bit brutal. Can Poison dart through to the vent? He's got the first, but Zywoo trades. Low HP, RPK goes first. Vitality plays things by the books. And the numbers, well, they're split right down the middle. Eight to seven, favor of Cole, but no idea where this one's going. Stick around, ladies and gents. We've got more Counter-Strike coming up.
with the ESL Pro League Season 12. Everybody, it's complexity taking on vitality. And we are ready to get the second half of Nuke underway. We enjoy having you. We love you to pieces. We hope you love us too. And we'll leave it right there at that. Harry Hugo, those are my goons. <laughs> Not goonies, just goons. Yeah. Straight goons. <laughs> we're, we're the muscle, dude. We, uh, yeah, we, we don't want to talk about that any more than we have to. Kind of like my two left hands almost. Well. There ain't nothing right about either one of you. <laughs> No, all right. No, I like it. I like it. It went in a better place than I thought it was. So, so did uh, Jinji, who also just 16 6 on the second map. So that series is done. We're woo! jumping in the second half, and it looks like a, a fast, squeaky play here, Harry. Yeah, it does. Shox has been able to sneak his way down the bed like a little gremlin boy into the back line. Not a normal boy, gremlin one. You want to be feeding this guy after midnight, that's for sure. And here's Oboe, tucked on down. That's Poison at the ramp room to help him out. Out through the double doors comes RPK, Config, and Oboe able to take this round by storm. And Complexity, they just flood the ramp. They just take those fights while they're being given. And they've left the Vitality side in a pretty bad shape. It's all onto shots. And now, well, no one. Oboe with a stellar pistol round here. Complexity. Picking up lucky number nine. Yeah. You go, why is your why is number nine your lucky number? Uh, because it's, you know, one smaller than ten and one bigger than eight. And I just I, I can't think of any other reason, Harry. Um <laughs> four for config in his wow. opening pistol, four for Oboe in his. And I wanted to mention Apex was on silo there. You talk about that ramp rotate for complexity. Vitality were fully stacked, going lower, uh, with a player on silo to watch for those secret rotations. There weren't any. Um, full rotate down ramp for Cole, and they avoid that lurker. Fast out A on this force. Mizuta with a Mac. He's somehow going to get that kill at the end of the clip. And Zyru does follow up. It's somehow, some way up in the open. Bomb dropped Oboe, holding onto the site, stalling the round out, and buying time for his team. It's important stuff. Shox does respond with a P250 and Apex on the flank as well. Oh, dude, the gun swap. It falls into Apex's hands, but he gets the kill before he needs it. Blame F. A long way from home, all alone. One on three. Can't believe Poison just helped out the enemy like that. Just dropped yes. his gun down through the... Uh... Why is he doing that? He was trying to trade weapons. He didn't actually give the gun. Apex swapped it out immediately. I don't know, man. We all but saw it's it. The, it's I mean, the weapon it's... swapping that, that got him caught off guard, right? It not only told Apex that there was a player above the ladder, but it also, you know, he's swapping guns. He can't shoot when you don't hold a gun. Kind of simple there. Well, you're right. Which brings us to a very important topic about gun law. I'm kidding. We're not doing that. Not today. Not ever. Because the only laws I want to talk about are the ones of gravity right now that are complexity. Losing this lead. Ooh. Yeah, you see the catch out. Cool, you in the swap. He'll take it. Cat jam, man. Oh, dear. <laughs> we all know what that timer means. Let us know using the hashtag ESL Pro League. How long are we going to be waiting to get this game back underway? And what animal are you drawing Harry as today? I mean, the oh, world's your oyster. We're back. And maybe Harry's your oyster. Harry can be your oyster for the right price. Yeah. A free 99. So get over there on MS Paint and show us your best. There are actually some really good drawings. My favorite one was the one that was done of Henry. 
when they thought that yeah. Hugo sounds like Henry and then they realized they weren't even meant to be drawing. <laughs> yeah, he, he, mess he DM'd me on Twitter. He said um, <laughs> he got everything wrong. It was great drawing, but he thought that um, Hugo was Henry's stage name and that I was Henry. What? And then he thought that we were drawing Henry, i.e. me, Hugo, Henry G, the same, apparently the same person. I'm confused. Um, we're drawing him Hang as a on. horse. So he drew Henry as a horse, not me, and not Harry, who we were actually trying to draw. <laughs> it really didn't make a lot of sense. Oh, but hold on, we've, the the was really we've, all had, we've all had an afternoon of staring at the wall and ceiling. Uh, Let's be most honest. days, Trace, most evenings, actually. I would say mornings, but I'm barely conscious. Ah, yes, of course. Here we go. We're looking at a pretty salty buy here on the side of complexity. And this could just be the round that puts us on even kilter. Well, hilter, kilter. Psych. Oh, well, that was not the graphic we meant to show you. That was the internal scripting there for the, the match itself. Of course, these are not real players. These are all bots that we've kind of designed these games and these rounds in a certain way just for you. You guys would never understand. Calling config a bot? No, I'm just saying, like, we wrote kind of like all the path and all the movement. We wrote all yeah. that out by hand. And and the, the, the way we can prove that is by spoiling the script. So temporarily, I'll tell you, Vitality, they're going to win this round. And I know that. that that's, that's the only thing that remains true right here, right now. So as you can see, it's all calculated. It's all part of the plan. Yeah, Shock's dying. That was supposed to happen. Apex missing his shot. Also oh, completely oh, calculated as the curse is not lifted. Okay. It's laid down upon us. Right. Please, Hugo, don't stop there. How will we ever know the rest of the story? Well, Vitality, they're obviously going to get the bomb plant, right? That's for free. Cole, no way they can retake, because as we know, these rifles are going to win the round versus the low economy of Cole. So retake on for the CTs. Coming through the door, Oboe. What gun does he go with? It's the Mac-10, obviously. It's in the script. We know. We expect it. And he gets out into the site already through the smokes. I were gone. And this is all going as calculated. All going as planned. <laughs> Vitality, not a worry. I'm not sweating. <laughs> Are you? And they're on the defuse. It's not a worry. Oh, they're going to open the door. They're going to shoot him in the face. And they're going to win the round. Simple as that. Well, you can wow. see the quiver, but it's not over with. I'm just kidding. This is pretty much done. Blame has no kit. And well, for Hugo, you can tell he's sweating in his britches all the way from over here, but... Man, that one got a little close, Hugo. Yeah, any teams want to pick me up to curse their opponents? You know, that's <laughs> it's not cheap, but I can do it. Uh, I've got my my crystal ball and my cauldron. I'm a bit of a bit of a witch, not really a Jew druid. I don't know. Words are hard, man. But uh, cursing, that's easy. Vitality, they're going to pick it up, as, like we all expected. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Here we God. are, nine to nine, yeah. and my oh my, as Hugo is, I mean, this is, yeah, this is exactly <laughs> what we were expecting, right? And here we are. It's, uh, it's, it's a gun buy for Vitality. And Blame with the one AK, he just couldn't shake Apex. And so that there is the AK already removed. It does get juggled into the hands of Poison, but he doesn't have armor. Um, well, that means that he's going to get aim punched every bullet that comes his way. So we all feel bad for Poison. Shocks as well is waiting for a player. He's like daring them to take a peek down the vent. You guys think you can deal with the oh, vent? Well, okay. Oh, In all right, case oh, yeah. is USP doing even more damage. But thankfully now it's all on some Poison. 1v3. He's got this AK from earlier on. Out through the oh, heavens. Buddy. Almost a follow up. But luckily enough, Masuta swings by to help out. How you doing over there, Trace? You enjoying the match? Pretty pretty tight, pretty competitive series Dude, right it's, now. It's cut right down the middle, isn't it? Fan cams back on the cards. Hello, all of you beautiful people. Even the chair right there, you're beautiful too. They actually picked up the stream feed in the fan cam. I don't know if that's a fan doing it or if the stream's also in the in the cool. It might be. I mean That's cool. Yeah, I mean, no? you know, at that point. It's just like double the power of the screen. So, anyway, back to you, Harry. Yeah, man, thank you very much, Trace. I was wondering when I was going to get my turn. Blame. He's been waiting for his turn as well, and it's his go. Apex. Shot in the back. Pretty grisly way to get removed. RPK, can he bear the weight of this round out through the heart? He is completely caught a time in here, but Rush has realized. 
And that one gets laid to rest pretty convincingly for Cole on their first rifle round. That was so close. Yeah, that 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 like that like poison a... got robbed, man. Hashtag poison got robbed. Let's get it trended. Or let's not. Vitality, they're broke. They've lost all their money. <clears throat> and that's why this round is the most important of all. Nothing to show but a couple of dirty digs. Poison, robbing them back, or trying to. It's just such an awkward fight for Blame have to take anyway. Yeah, it's just not even worth it at a certain point. Like, you know, Blame's going to hit it eventually, but it's the, the fear that you get things on the way down. And so the spray, that's far safer. RPK gone. Aids for poison. Config swooping up those eco kills. Who doesn't love them? Ah, uh, nice little pre-fire from Config too. Ah, yes. This I'm feels glad. good, man. Um, he dropped, he, he got dinged from, from the silo, so he drops his gun and just looks at the ground like, yep, yeah, I'm not playing until the round is over. Five on one. And the round, it's over. Five on five. Back in with another one. They just keep running them back, no matter what we do to stop them. 11 to 10, Cole in control, but for how long as Vitality now have the guns? A lot of aggression outside here for Blaine. He really goes for it, and he's not alone. Apex is... Taken out by Poison's AWP, and that's created a very interesting dilemma here for Vitality. Who, on the back of some weapons, have not found much success in this round. Five on three, they're going to try to barrel their way out of this hut area. But here comes a Rush. He's hanging on top of the hut. King of the hut, even. It's just up to Zaiwu. One on five. You go who's going to win this round. Just kidding, you didn't answer fast enough. It was Rush and complexity. So, 12 to zero. 12 to 0. That's quite dominant, Trace. With how the one in front of it. 12 it to 0 with the one in front of it. Whoa, dude. Course. Cole haven't dropped around. We're back in time in um, the first half. Also, something else that I think is important to mention as to why this series is that much more important is that if Complexity yeah. pick up the win here, they guaranteed that playoff spot. It's true. That's what the calculations have said. That's what they've told us. And that's what we love. We do yeah, love that. You love it. You wear it. Yeah. If you're not wearing it already, then what are you really doing? Harry, most of your outfits are pretty complex on that note. It is, man. Yeah, like I you got it from Complex, it. the magazine. So. <laughs> yeah, man. I just ordered them out of magazines. Pretty old-fashioned in that sense. I pick up the old <laughs> blower, and I'm like, yeah, what's up, mate? Uh, you want to ship me that in my size? And they Wait, know the me blower? Is that there. the phone? That's the phone. Oh, I never heard that one. Usually you go, man, are you even British? I, I, I believe it less and less by the day. <laughs> oh, nice oh, shot. Look at this. That's nice. It's clean. Everyone loves a nice clean round, don't they? Mm. Tactical timeout for Vitality, rightfully so, as they find themselves down 13 to not zero, but to 10, actually. My brain miscalculated it earlier. And look at Rush, he's just having a good old time. Ah, Mr. Will. That's what you guys can refer to him as. Mr. Will. Mr. Will. Wow, look at that picture of you, Trace, as a turtle. You see that on the right? Shella. What Your tarnation? Hella cool, my guy. And I... Oh, oof. not much to Shella say about that. Oh, shall we get back into the action here? It's 13 to 10. It's another gun round for Vitality. Trace is shaking his head, but mm -mm -mm. in other usual... Actually, I don't know where I'm going with that. We'll, oh. we'll move past it. Or for Zaiwu, he's got no armor. He's got 20 kills, though. He's top of the server right now. And... Uh, yeah, man. Flames made the cross. Zaiwu did see him, though. That's info. Yeah. How are you guys doing? Just sitting back, hanging out at Cedar Creek, you know? The golf course and nuclear power plant where there's terrorist activity. 
but not a whole lot of activity here for Vitality. This will be a good round for them to get back in, or we just kind of say, you know what, it really didn't go your way, except for that first half of play. Yeah, in their back uh, pocket, they've got Vertigo, um, a map that they, Vitality even 16-2 call on backup blast. So, you know, there's that to worry about for Cole. You know, if they win their map pick, it does set us up for a three mapper. Obviously, you know, never know. The game of counter strike. Just, I don't know, man. I always think like Blame F, he's not someone who's gonna take a 16-2 hand and then be like, yeah, well, this just ain't a map for us. You know, I feel like he sees <laughs> yeah. that and he's like, well, there's a lot of room to improve then, isn't there? He's like that really positive guy that no one else can like get on the same wavelength as because he doesn't seem real. And that's kind of the vibe he gives off. But here's the outside play for Vitality. They've got two here. Config opening up on one of these players back in the lobby. Now, 30 seconds as this push is hoping to come through, and those were not the results you were Ooh, hoping for. Zai Wu in with one, but that bomb is dropped back in the lobby, and I think now he's realizing like, there's just no time. It's just not happening, and Oboe does run around and run amok in the round. There's 14 now on the board for complexity. There's also no money for Vitality up against 14. Now, everything I've just said is a really nasty spot to be in if you are the Frenchman here. Yeah, why would you say that, Harry? I yeah. can't believe you. Yeah, it was all I my fault, better of really. You. Yeah, you should be hyping this up a little bit more and stuff. Wow, I mean, they've got no money here on Vitality, but, you know, this is where you really get to show what you're made of, right? This is where you dig deep, you come in with a force by, or maybe an eco, you know, it's a matter of opinion. They've gone with the force, and now we see, can they show us how oh, great they my. are with these pistols? The uh, answer, looking like no, as Rush has tripled up on the top of the hut, looking for a bit more, and Rush hey. is in with four. Five now on the cards, and Rush... He's keen for it. Yeah. Shoxy back in main, doesn't want to give the ace over, but there's only so much you can say about the ace when you get shot in the face. It's Rush offering up the goods. 15 for complexity as they reach map point. Yeah, you talk about getting shot in the face, that's one thing, but how about the blistering pace at which Vitality try to do something in that round? Obviously, it all goes by very fast. You're gonna see it here in a second. Rush with the answer, the man with the plan, at the right place at the right time, and with the willpower. I think we should just go with that. Yeah, I love how every player, like, they're kind of dying in waves, right? They're just running through the smoke. No one's looking up. No one's even, like, considering it. They're looking for the sight player or the heaven player. They're like, yeah, no, Rush, he won't kill five of us. He'll be fine. Uh, Rush, well, he kills five of us. It wasn't five of them. It wasn't fine. Uh, nice nade onto Shox, who does cross down B. Apex about to walk past Blame. Oh, dear, this is not a safe crossfire. Poison in heaven, Blame in the garage. Not a lot of freedom for Apex. And so he's going to time his late coming into this ace site after his teammates on Vitality inside of door. After that goes conflict, there's the timing. Blame hits a shot. Shocks has yet to cross. And Blame is considering there could be more outside. He's right. Does he hang around for the fight? He does. And now back to the hut. It's Rush again. He won't be able to 3K them now, but there's plenty more CTs where that came from. Oh, Config, there's two, and just Masuta left on the other side, but he has got this one close. He's made it doable. He's got an ace now as well. Are we going to have back-to-back -back aces or do complexity? Get this game locked in, or this map, rather. He might want to drop the vents, and that is a decision he's going to come to regret. Complexity locking their map pick. They get on 